Good morning, guys. Welcome to a new vlog. We're in Montana. Yeah. Holy cow, they're cute! This is for today. <laughs> I'm gonna show you guys outside because outside looks so dope. So it is actually, I think it's like 8 a.m. here right now, which back home it would be 10, 10 p.m. Um, it's interesting how when I was flying, literally the time changes were every single spot that we stopped at. I'm gonna try and do a better house tour or a better room tour, but we're staying at the cutest little motel. It is so adorable, guys. I don't think you guys even understand. Okay, I just wanted to do a quick little room tour because we just got in. Literally, it is so late and we're both so ready to sleep, but how cute is this room? Oh my God, this decor is everything. I'm obsessed. Look at, I mean, the wall lamps, this sofa bed. I love it, this futon. Are you joking? No way. Okay, I gotta mess with that and figure that out. I'm so tired. I might do a better tour for you guys. I'm so sorry, guys. Um, but this is the bathroom. It has like barn doors. And I think it was, <laughs> that's for me and Miles. That'll, that'll be interesting. And just got in from our flights. Looking real rough. But this bathroom, like, wow, I love this tile. Okay, their designer freaking kicked butt. So I think Bozeman, or that's where we're saying we're in Bozeman, is like a city where they mainly do motels because of the mountain views. Like they don't have like a lot of high rises unless you're closer to the airport. So that's what we've observed for like the little bit that we've been here. But there's a bunch of like really retro, very like industrial, very <laughs> cool motels here. And this is one of the cutest. Like when I saw it online, I was like, no way it looks this cute in person. And it literally looks this cute in person. So don't ask me why I did a full face of makeup just to go literally across the street to their cafe. Let's see if these docks are gonna be able to withstand the ice and the snow. I think they are. I mean, they're pretty, I guess we'll see when I was on TikTok, obviously because that's where I go and find all my information a lot of people that came to this city said that a great place to stay was this place which is called the RSVP motel because it has like a very retro style and like they took a super old motel which has been here literally since the start of this town and they turned it into like they revamped it obviously remodeled it and made it super retro like our alarm clock is like this little jukebox looking thingy and like the fridge and the record player it is so cute and even like the vibe outside with the lights let me show you shut up like can you guys see it they have like this super old school retro motel sign and they have like a fire pit right there and that right there is where I'm about to go right now to go get some food from the cafe. This is the problem I have with Miles. He's so tall and he puts things up so high and I don't know where anything is. I can't see. Oh. Of course, we gotta call Nina. Hi Nina, say hi to the vlog. Okay, so this place is called Farmer's Daughter. So cute. These are paleo chocolate chip. I don't know if that means anything. This is breakfast for today. Very yummy. Love it, love it. You look so cute. Are you liking Montana? I love Montana. Really? Montana. <laughs> suits me yeah okay this is his dream right now oh, he's living the dream Nature oh Valley. maybe we should leave that in the car you think oh yeah yeah some of these are yeah. car snacks some of these are room snacks because you can't go wrong with a lot of snacks you need snacks yes 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 also need some soap oh lord miles should be uh no sponsored shape. by irish spring because as ghetto I as guy, irish it is he freaking irish loves spring. it we all, hey look, you be all, always talking about my skin and like, what's your secret? Irish Spring. <laughs> he does have glowing skin. Look at that skin, <laughs> my god. Okay, this is our survival pack for the yellow snow. For the yellow snow. We should probably not keep this bottle in there. Huh? Probably not keep this bottle in there. Oh, 
No, uh, anything that needs to go in the fridge, let it go in the fridge. We don't have any cokes. I, I, I have a feeling that we're gonna feel really good after Wim Hofing and like doing this. Yeah, yeah. I'm hoping that my back immediately just like everything just. Yeah, Miles has a lot of black back issues, and I feel like this is really gonna help. Uh, you know, there's. You this almost said black issues. <laughs> Miles has a lot of black issues. <laughs> All right, let's go. This one's taking a minute. You might as well wait. Oh yeah, you're right. It's Montana, Miles. Okay, it's a yeah, oh, we're technically in the. 5, feet. We're in the Rocky Mountain. Do you feel short of breath? No, I feel good. My lung capacity is there. Fun fact: Did you know that Ethiopia is actually really, like sits, uh, or the capital city sits on a really high altitude, and that's why we have like really great lung capacity. Do you? Because I've seen you work out. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so if you've never been to Montana, you might not know that there is a lot of beautiful mountains. And since we went in the winter time, my God, these views are breathtaking. However, also very terrifying because we were driving on snow and we weren't really used to it. So just be aware of that. If you plan on going to Montana in the winter, you will need to get used to driving on snow. It also took us about, I want to say an hour and a half, maybe two hours on this day to get to the Yellowstone. And there was zero traffic nothing stopping us it was amazing They don't look like real. Oh, look, they look like reindeers. It's prancing. Hi! Hello! <laughs> So Miles and I decided to be adventurous and go on a little hike in the Yellowstone National Park and it was minus 40 degrees outside so it was horrifically cold but I had my GoPro with me so you can't hear too much of the audio when it's in the waterproof case but I just want to show you guys a little bit of how dreamy the outside looked. It's so beautiful in the winter time. We knew that we were gonna go to the hot springs and do a little soak in there afterwards so we figured if we were a little cold now it was gonna be okay. <laughs> if you can see, well, you probably can't, but there's like a bunch of bison over there. Look at that mountain. The views are about to be spectacular. Oh, by the way, this is the Yellowstone um, hot springs. This is like the use, this is the actual part that you can get into because there's no hot spring that you can get into in the park. So, yeah. Ooh. Are you kidding me? I swear to God. Okay, so we're at the hot springs and it is so nice. <laughs> Keep playing. Oh, I'm playing all my life. Anyway, my phone's about to die. And look at my background. Get through so cute. Look at my big forehead. <laughs> it's so warm. But it's also so cold. Literally, if I didn't have mascara, you can't see it now. Miles' eyelashes are freezing over. Yeah. These mountains are so pretty. 
What is it? It's hold on, let's see what the temperature is. Definitely so. Oh, that can't be right. It says the high is uh, 19 today. High is 19? Yeah. Oh, that's not bad. It was if like you five see, on the way up there. There's like icicles, all the little branches over here. They have icicles on them from the steam that's coming up. And really serene. How do you feel? I'm not gonna lie, Miles. I feel like I'm on clouds. Like I feel so. I do too. I feel like somebody took like My a back roller. My hurt at all. My, I felt like I was breathing the cleanest air. I don't know. Honestly, I still feel like I'm breathing the cleanest air. I think I cured my tonsillitis just by being there. Like maybe I'm being a little OD a little bit, but or maybe you never had tonsillitis. Definitely. Oh, but I am ashy eight. Yeah. I got lotion though, so we got some for that. In the house. Not here. In my bag. Oh. Because I'm not you. Okay. No, guys. If you're coming to the Yellowstone or coming to this area at all, like this is the. The views, everything. Like this spot. You will see a lot of wildlife too. Yeah. It's literally like a reverse zoo. Miles is waiting for me and today is the next day. I, when I tell you guys, I swear to you, going to the hot springs has really just loosened up my throat. I don't know if I was just taking in all that steam or what the situation is, but my tonsillitis, I can still tell like there's a little bit of swelling, but it's not as painful. And it's amazing, you know? I can survive as long as the pain is not there. Especially because the dry, the, uh, the air outside is so cold and so dry. Today it's snowing again, um, and today was supposed to be our ski day, but I've been trying to book online, and it is all booked up, and Miles had a fantastic idea of just driving up there just showing up and if you know if we can book it for tomorrow great problem is I really want to do um, a quick little like snowboarding lesson because I want to actually like take a lesson before going out and hitting the slopes just so that we're not a danger to ourselves or others but we're gonna see we're gonna try and book it today if not we're probably just gonna visit the town and hang around uh, you guys already saw this outfit I'm not doing a lot of outfit showing you guys a lot of my outfits because I already documented every single thing that I packed for this trip in the last video uh, which I posted bought these glasses all from Amazon and I will I honestly I will link everything for you guys just so that you guys if you are new to the channel or this is the first video you're watching all the links are there but let's go Oh, by the way, we are staying in Bozeman. Did I already say that? I can't remember. We're staying in Bozeman and we're gonna try and go to the Bridger Bowl ski area. That's the goal. Mountain miles on a mountain, just mountaining along. Okay, we made it up to the ski lodge and holy cow, look at this. These trees. It's so beautiful. I just forced Miles to give me his hat because it's snowing really hard. It's a hat so wonky. It's snowing really hard and it started, uh, my hair started curling up, but it's so beautiful up here. Also, I wanted to vlog and talk to you guys a little bit more in the car, but really quickly, that really pretty scene of mountain and trees turned into driving on the cliff of the mountain and we got really scared and uh, yeah that wasn't gonna happen but it's still snowing like literally hasn't stopped but these trees like are you joking how unreal is this We're at the cutest little antique store and they have a bunch of hats. I'm trying to get Miles a cool hat. I'm telling 
any of these lighter colors look so good on you. Does it? Yeah. Ooh. Empty. Ooh, this would be a really cool gift to get. So this is downtown Bozeman. Also, Bozeman is such a cute little mountain town and there's a lot of money here. I'll just tell you guys that. These are where people build their second homes, million dollar homes. They're rich, okay? This is the life we're aspiring for. Can only 